What's up guys? It's a late start today. It's been raining all day today and it rained all day yesterday. Um, don't forget to like this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell right down below. Um, right now we are on our way to the store. Just, just got to grab a couple of random things. I forget what she wanted. Um, but yeah, we'll go do that real quick. Hopefully we get more calls today because it is no longer raining and the, the ground is drying. So try to get some work done, I guess. They used to be white hen, I believe. Hello. I'm good. Glad that it's not raining anymore. Okay, we are off. It was actually only one item. I thought she wanted a few different things, but it ended up being an easy one. Two minutes. It was three dollars. Hello. Hey, Have a good one. Yeah, we got that one delivery done. Heading back home. Hopefully we get more calls. So I've decided it's been way too long since the last time I drove this machine was when I broke my collarbone. She looks really ugly. She took a tumble. But she still runs. I had to do a few things. I, I messed up. So when I crashed, I accidentally disconnected the power cable. The, the cable ripped in half. So I wasn't able to shut it off. After I crashed, it still worked. But I couldn't shut it off and I was all broken. So the only thing I could think to do in the moment, because I was trying to throw it in a car and go. Because um, you have to shut the wheel off because it's still in gear. If you try to lift it up, the wheel will start spinning. So I had to rip the seat off of the machine and then pull all the wires out of the motherboard. And that's how I was able to shut it off. Because I've done a lot on this wheel. This was one of my wheels that I used to use in Boston. And um, my other wheel too, the, the Monster Pro, the one with the flat tire, that's another wheel that I used to use in Boston. It's the wheel that I was just riding. That's the one that I bought specifically for Haber. And I got that almost nine months into my first, like I started last year around January. And um, so far it's holding up all right. So I started last year in January. So we're already over a year now. I ended up buying the machine, the new machine. I got it in the fall time, probably actually mid-august maybe i don't remember the exact time but um i got the new wheel and since then i've already put 8500 miles on it crazy just driving around haverhill i mean i've taken a couple long rides like out of town but not much but yeah we have went all around through these little neighborhoods over here and she's still going strong I really don't want to fall. I'm holding about a thousand dollars worth of cameras right now. But so far she's doing all right. Everything works. It's just, I need to get a new seat. She looks a little mangled up and broken, but... I mean, so far she, the, the gimbal seems to work all right. The only thing I would be scared of is it cutting out on me while I'm going fast. So right now, I guess I might be mistaken. I might actually have two wheels. See, it's one thing for me to test drive it. I really need to take it out and see what it's really about. But um, it's one thing to test drive it. It's another thing to have about $100 worth of merchandise in your hands and then fall. So I need to make sure that one, the wheel is safe for my safety. And two, I need to make sure that it's safe so that I don't lose money because I spend a lot of money on some of these orders. I could only imagine dropping $150. I could only imagine dropping a $150 order because it's not on the restaurant and it's not on the store to replace that, it's on me. But yeah, so far so good. I mean 
I don't have a speedometer on this wheel, so I don't know how fast we're going. But we're probably doing a good 20 miles an hour cruising, doing all right. So far, so good. It looks like we have three wheels instead of two. I need to figure out it's looking like I need to figure out like some type of roll cage. I want to fix this up and make it not look like a bum. Because honestly, if I was to drive this into some restaurant and put it down, they'd probably look at it like it's going to explode. Because it really doesn't look too appealing to the eye. Um, definitely want to make her look pretty. Like I have a pretty good feeling when I know something's going to give out. And I think it's alright. Because honestly, yeah, it bounced down the road a little bit, but... But it's looking like we have two wheels now in operation. So far, the only damage that looks like was sustained to it from the crash is the power button. Like it got split in half and that's why I couldn't shut it off. Moving forward, after ripping the seat off and all of like ripping it apart to get to the motherboard, it is a little, the frame is a little bent, but that doesn't that doesn't matter too much. I know if one of them dies, I have another one to jump on. Okay, so right now we are on our way to Richdale's. Uh, we need to grab a few things. Yeah, I think he wants either a two liter or a 20 ounce. I'll have to check the message. Drop that off down Cedar Street. So it's right there. So we'll take a quick cruise through Haverhill. Okay, we just left Richdale's. We got what we need. We're just gonna go drop this off down the street over here. How are we doing, brother? It was 13.49. I'm getting better and better. I just left there. That was a credit card sale. It used to take me a while to punch it in, like, cause right now all I can do is I can either type in the credit card number or I can tap it for some reason my square reader like the one that I use to swipe it doesn't work but yeah it used to take me a while to type it all in because the only way that I can get it to work is you have to know your zip code too like your billing zip code because since I'm typing it in it's almost like I'm typing it in as an online order I don't know it's weird sometimes I try to avoid using credit cards just because it charges the customer a 3% fee. And they're too. gonna get taxed on that regardless, you know what I mean? So it's like, it's better to just avoid using a credit card because when I run it through my machine, it I have to take a 3%. But yeah, we just finished that number two of the day. Today's gonna be a slow one. I mean, I'm sure we probably will get our afternoon wave 
we'll get a bunch of them all at the same time but for the moment it's pretty slow okay so we just got what we need at richdale's we're leaving to go drop this off over by walnut square right now call which is pretty much in the same area that we just came from so we busted a quick u-turn at the end of the bridge and now we're on our way back over to where we just came from two two liters of coke and a ginger ale i'm hoping it doesn't rain again today i don't know we'll see yeah we'll hit um the richdales right over here on the right i mean on the left we are on our way back to home base. Hopefully we get another delivery before we get there. Hopefully we don't get that delivery right before we get there and have to turn around again. I would always prefer to be busy with like one after another, after another, after another. That way I'm not coming in and out, in and out. It's not really worth it to come out for one at a time. It's more worth it to get stuff done. So yeah, we're gonna hit Market Basket straight ahead. And then from there, we'll try to be as quick as possible, make our way across the bridge over here and grab that sub. That's a thing that I need to start doing. So I'm not a good shopper. I like, I like to follow lists. I shop for people, but I don't know how to shop for, my, for myself. Okay. You got what I need. She says she's just a friend. She says she's just a friend. Oh baby, you, you got what I need. 
I won't quit my day job, don't worry. So maybe if we go with the green grapes. Hello. Do you have a YouTube channel? I do. Are you like this? I am. Like as a recently? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I just started like a week and a half ago. Oh my god! I feel so famous. <laughs> maybe in Haverhill, but nowhere else. We just left Market Basket alive and well. I got the Gatorades. We got the grapes in the backpack. The wind is picking up. I'm on my way to pick up the sub at Mediterranean. I have a feeling it's gonna be very tasty. Oh yeah, the sub's for me. I shouldn't be waving for people to go because I don't know if he's got a red light or not. I thought he was stopping for me. That's why I'll wave often because like I said, I'm planning on going behind you and then someone stops and it like creates traffic. Stuff wow. like that, if I already see you and I'm already anticipating going behind you, I don't want you to see me. I want you to continue doing what you're doing so that everything will go smoothly. Because if you freak out and slam on your brakes, it just creates static that we don't want. Okay, we made it to meds. And the red fruit. Hello. I'm here to pick up a ham and cheese sub. Thanks. You have a good one. We got what we need. Actually, we have to hit a store for two separate people. Get both of those deliveries done. They both live over like in Central Haverhill, kind of near each other. So we'll try to get both of those done at the same time. And then we're gonna have to hit the store and go up to Westgate. So it's three store orders, one Dunkin' Donuts order. We are at Dunkin' Donuts. Hello. Two orders at Red Hen right now. Drop both of those off near where they gotta go. And then we'll come back to Red Hen and go up River Street. up up um, River Street real quick and then we'll come back and get the other deliveries done since they're both going in the same direction okay we made it to Red Hen we just gotta run inside real quick so we've only made it about halfway up River Street and man this wind is brutal I'm literally hitting it head-on and I'm barely able to go over 20 miles per hour it's uh, magic. No, it has a gyro. No, it's electric. 
Oh, wow. Yeah. Beautiful. Thank you, brother. Bunch of monster energy drinks and a prescription. It's a nice combo. Now we are on our way. Scared of you. At first, she put in your wrong name. No, oh, she. There As is. I was walking away, she was like, "Oh, sir, wait, wait." And my partial is probably sitting there. Have a good no, one, man. River Street, to get to these other deliveries. The danger that's involved with a vehicle like this—you want everything to work perfect. Okay, so. Maybe I know all your secrets, but you tell me stupid lies. Oh, you think you can escape now and got it all just figured out you can fake it through the ceiling to the rooftops while i'm leaving you're my greatest mistake greatest mistake left red hen right now we are on our way to drop off our first delivery and then we're gonna buzz over and drop off the second one right after that okay we just stopped at the store I got hit up by someone else so we found ourselves here at market basket in the middle of our other delivery I don't even know we got like five deliveries we need to get done right now um, I still haven't even responded to one of them because I got my hands full but what we're gonna do is we're gonna drop this off then we're gonna drop the other order off and then we have creamer in our bag that we need to go drop off. We already picked that up at Market Basket. Hey, it's wet over here. Okay. Hey, how come you have to use your card? Because I didn't have enough cash on me. Okay, so we just dropped that off. We're on our way to go drop off the next delivery, but we're fighting wind right now, of course. Okay, so we just got that delivery done. Now we just need to swing over to Newcomb Street right over here. Bust this right. And then from here we're going to go to McDonald's. What up, brother man? Hi, uh, Keegan. My sister's got to see you. Hello. Hi, Keegan. Hello. <laughs> Thank you so much. Have a, Have a good one. We just got three of them done right there. And we still have the creamer in our backpack. We got to drop that one off. But McDonald's will be a lot quicker because the food's waiting for us right now. 
we gotta just go straight across the bridge and then come back over the bridge and drop it off right there at Two Water Street. Okay, we stopped at Richdale's. We got the diet, diet coke and the chips like earlier. So we're just going up Cedar Street. We're gonna get this done real quick. We need to make it to McDonald's. I just didn't want to have to come all the way back over here since I was already over here. Okay, we got that delivery done. Now we are back on track. We're on our way to McDonald's. And we got the wind pushing us back. Oof. I just definitely hit my hand on that sign. Probably just broke my hand right there, of course. Can never catch a break. Right here, I smacked my hand. Okay, we'll send her a quick picture. Okay. Okay, we just dropped off the creamer. Apparently I dropped off the McDonald's at the wrong spot. Super bad on my part. For some reason, the GPS made it look like it was the nursing home next door to Market Basket. And of course, the food was supposed to go to Market Basket. So I'm racing back over there and drop off on River Street. It looks like we won't be going to Red Hen. We're going to stop at a different store over by Chicken Connection. I really hope the food is still here. Hello. This is for Michelle. Thank you. I'm excited to see myself smash my hand on the, the sign. I hope I got it on camera. Awesome. Okay, we are on our way to Chicken Connection to drop off a massive milkshake. I highly doubt whoever drinks this will be able to drink it without getting a stomach ache. Of course, we're gonna fight the wind the entire way. Okay, we made it. like 15. Okay. Yeah. It was cheaper because it wasn't a card. Because oh, okay. I paid cash. So it was like 15 bucks. Okay, so here's and then plus the five. Thank and you. Whatever else. Appreciate it. Awesome. Oh, there you go. Okay, so we just dropped off at Chicken Connection. And we just need to run. Okay, so right now we are on our way to River Street. Yep, they didn't have what we needed. So we have to stop at Red Hen over here. Definitely annoying to have to work like that. But it's nobody's fault but my own. Okay, so we stopped at the store. Right now I am heading up River Street. My hand feels broken. I think I have a boxer fracture because I hit the top of my hand with the, the metal post. But yeah, when I squeeze or if I use it the wrong way, I can I can feel it. It's windy still, so it's not that bad. Fingers crossed, it stays this way. We've pretty much been able to keep up with traffic the entire way. Max, I saw you flying. Thank you. There you go. My surgery is Wednesday. I Thank cannot you. do much. Yeah, give me a call. Me, unless it's normal stuff. Okay. No, I'm serious. Oh, but I'm going to have you go to Wednesday. Okay. Okay, so we are on our way to McDonald's in Bradford. And then from there, we need to go to Hilldale Pizza and drop. So we got two right now. This key 
Michigan, Ken. We're gonna hit up Mickey D's, Mickey Donald's. Oh, so it's nothing crucial. It's just an annoyance. What up? Yeah, I know. I saw the beat. I saw you. What are you doing? Uh, working. Dude, you fucking die. Okay, we are at Hildell Pizza. Just got the food. For them to let me pay. Do you ever work with uh fucking Okay, so at the moment we're on our way to drop off this two pizzas, two subs and fried pickles. I don't think I like fried pickles. I don't think I've ever tried them, but I don't think I want to try them. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut around and we're going to come up Grove Street because that just seems like a better idea. Washington, we should be arriving in about one minute. If I'm not mistaken, it's pretty much right off of High Street. I ended up getting a decent amount of orders. Probably got like 25 orders in tonight and I thought it was going to be a very slow night. Because I had a late start today. Yeah, it's a left. A left and then destinations on the left. So let's go this way. Three thirty-five. So we definitely passed it. me back and I'll be doing like 10 miles per hour and my odometer will say I'm doing 30 but we're cruising right now it feels like there's almost no power going into it to get this fast 